from squishing clay between her fingers to feeling the strokes of a paintbrush dance along the white pages. Diana has always had a passion for breathing life into a canvas. It was a career that sort of took hold of me a little bit more than me taking hold of it. Diana Bonder is a children's illustrator and author. And although that hasn't always been her career in life, the desire and influence has been there from an early age. I remember in my library as a child taking where the wild things are out of the library probably 15, 20 times just because of the illustrations. I thought they were so amazing. I've always drawn, I've always wanted to draw, so not illustrating for me would be, would be painful, so <laughs> illustrating is necessary. And Diana has created dozens of characters for writers. I love to create characters, I love to be given a story and, and told, you know, breathe life into it. I love that, taking words on a piece of paper and then dreaming something up. What is this character going to look like? Diana has illustrated 13 books and written a few of her own as well. Her favorite one so far is ABC. What was the inspiration behind it? It was a love for the alphabet, um, love for the sea, and then music. And it all just kind of came together as this sort of uh, symphony which runs the course of the alphabet. Do you find there's a theme in your books that there's accidental alphabet? dog a bit. I definitely become the alphabet queen. I think what children have started to really uh, expect with my books is not only um, kind of fun stories and interesting illustrations, but there's uh, this predominant uh, seek and find element in all of the illustrations. So at the back of each book, there will be um, a glossary of all the things that you have to find in each and every painting. Each piece of artwork Diana does for her books can later be purchased as an original. She takes these pieces of artwork along with her books into schools to share her experiences in writing and illustrating. Kids are really, they really think it's amazing when they watch you draw. Children tend to think the way things are with computers and that is that everything comes from a computer. They don't realize somebody actually has to draw that artwork. So for them to watch me draw, yeah, they're really, really think that's awesome. Judging by these drawings, you can clearly see Diana creates beautiful characters. But she says it's not solely her talent that has got her where she is today. When I was little, I, I loved to draw, but I, I, wasn't, I wasn't that kid in the class that everybody said, oh wow, she's going to be this artist. I was good, but I wasn't, wasn't great. So I always tell kids that it really doesn't come down necessarily to that, that talent, like you don't have to have this, this gift, it, it, it's passion. Diana says it's her determination to keep following her passion that has led her to live her dream every day. On Gabriella Island, I'm Rayanne LaPlante.